We stopped here at, uh, we're at East Shore Park and uh, to the long East Shore Drive here. It's very close to Ithaca. Just, Ithaca's right there. And uh, the lake you can see is just beautifully frozen over. We're going to walk down a ways here. And you can see the, there's the gulls out. Um, there's the ice that extends out about 100, 200 yards out into the lake here, very thin ice. Um, we're about a mile up the lake, and there's a whole flock of gulls, and we'll see that in a little bit. And uh, up the lake there, in the distance you can see the smoke that's Millican Station. And the lake goes up off to the right, and the gulls are congregated on the thin ice. And then you can see the pack ice. We're going to walk over this way a little bit. Yeah. So we'll give you a panorama here of how things look. You can see the beautiful lake ice. And there's the uh, there's the tents on there for the fe folks that are ice fishing, and uh, so we're gonna throw the scope on, and you guys can have some close-ups. So you can, folks, you can see the there all the gulls. Have you gone to uh, Game Farm? There are lots of red tails. We were up there this morning. There's like 20, 25 red tails. Oh wow! Yeah, and. Uh, black vultures, two black vultures. Okay. Um, I mean, we haven't, uh, we usually do big red nezra on campus. All right. Uh, but the red, red tails, um, but we did not find them this morning, but we think they, they may have been up in that bunch. So you can okay. see the, uh, I live on the, the South Hill, so we have a couple that they've got their spots. Uh -huh. I see them every day. Yeah. yeah I, I like the red tails. You can see that's, that's Stuart Park there in the background. So that's about, I don't know, it's like a, about a half mile, half mile of ice. Right. Yeah, I drove up to, right after I got back, again, I got that bug, and I had, I went to Montezuma, looking around, and I went all through the complex and saw nothing, and then driving home, I saw two bald eagles in the snowy white out. <laughs> Up near like that Savannah area yeah. up there, a little further north. We kind of had the same look when, when we go to Montezuma, it's like... Not exactly, we saw, we did, we saw more onus along the highway on the power poles than we yeah. did, exactly. you know, with with active nests and birds in them than we did at Montezuma. Yep, I had the exact same experience. Yeah, it's very I interesting. I suppose they, I guess they have a wildlife drive or whatever, and it's, I yeah. learned closed yeah. there during the, you know, it's a four mile drive, so hopefully you get in the heart of it. So you can see the folks, the the gulls are sitting on very, very thin ice out there. It's just, it's just a ribbon of ice. And they're loving it. You guys heard about the screech owl at the mini mart? No. Yeah. Up in uh, in Slaterville Springs. Oh, you're kidding? You know, yeah, of course. Yeah, yeah. You got, if you like owls, I love them. This thing. I'm going there this afternoon. I'm bringing a friend up there. Yeah. I went to see him last week. When you go to Slaterville Springs, have you ever been out 79? Sure. It's like the first gas station. Yeah. Years ago, it's called the Midnight Sun. It's the Dandy Mini Mart. Right. That little 35 mile an hour stretch. Right, right, right. Five minutes out of town. Yeah. Northwest corner of the parking lot. I mean, literally, you know, here's the yeah. parking lot and here's the tree. Yeah. And he's right there. Are you kidding? You can stand right under him. There's dogs, you know. He's living in a mini mart. I call him Slurpee. Um, <laughs> I it's love unbelievable. It. He comes out. He, he, the cavity, I think, is pretty deep. I've never seen him in the morning and I've never seen him midday. But uh, about four o'clock in the afternoon, he'll come up and he'll perch and he'll sit there and he'll slowly wake up. His eyes get bigger, <laughs> warms up. Sure enough, he's still there. Wow. We're going this afternoon, yeah. If you, it's worth the trip. He's so, pretty cool. So when you start out at 79, um, we usually go Thomas Road, 
to 79, kind of, we take Ellis Hollow and then Tom. Okay. Is, is that too far? Do we miss it? No, no, no. It's, it's further than that. Back left. No kidding. You can't By the beer it. sign. By the be the blue uh, beer oh, beer cave sign. Behind that, behind that. Okay. There's two light posts. And you can't miss it. I love it. The tree is right there, and the hole is, his little cavity is perfectly facing. Oh. Like, you can literally park your car directly under the tree. Right. And... He doesn't budge. <laughs> I love it. Yeah, I saw a dog walk by, uh, and he was kind of, you know, once yeah. the dog passed, that yeah. was the most that was, action I saw. Yeah. But he didn't, he wasn't scared. He, was, he, he wouldn't freak you or anything? Nope. Oh, I love it. I love it. Away. Love it. Yeah, worth, worth the trip. So we're searching for mergansers in the middle of the lake. Pretty annoying. He was sitting in that big tree facing away from me. It took almost 20 minutes to figure out that it was definitely an eagle. Not, I said, okay, it's definitely not part of the tree. It's just too big and massive what this branch is sitting on. And finally, he just like kind of wiggled his tail a little bit. I could see the white tail part. Oh, right, gotcha. You know, but he never really turned his head or did anything interesting. Oh man. So I just found it, but. Yeah. I wonder if that's a momzilla or girlzilla. Wouldn't be too far for them. Is that it right there? Where? Wait, in the tree? No, flying in. Oh, wait, you got something. Uh, my God, what is that? It looks like a kingfisher. It's it just had an interesting flight pattern. Again, I'm no expert, so... We wouldn't have a kingfisher here at this time of year, would we? It's in the back of the tree. Yeah. It's to the left of the RTH. Oh, wait, where'd you go, buddy? Left and up or below? Okay. Oh, oh there goes the RTH. Yeah. Come on, baby. Oh, oh there goes the king. There it goes. My God! Okay, it's a one? kingfisher! Yeah, it is. You sure? <laughs> you saw it? Oh my God! Yeah. Oh my God! Honey! So that one is going after. Uh, the other one? Yeah, so yeah, now we're. So where is the kingfisher? Flying around okay. the end of the roof. Okay, it's not behind the roof. Yeah, it was on the roof. Is he still there? No, he's flying back behind the roof. 